Okay, let me give you another example. Let's say, um, let's say you, you've got that same pendulum, um, the same as the, uh, the, the one in the previous video, two meters, okay? But now, you happen to be on the moon, okay? Um, so, so now you're, you're, you're on the moon. Um, the, the pendulum, how, how long will it, how long will it take to make one swing? Um, so, so, um, remember, on the moon, G on the moon is, um, uh, 1.622. So, so start with our formula. T equals, um, 2 pi, uh, uh, root L over G. Now, this, this is a magical formula. So, we don't know how it got there, but, um, uh, we'll, we're just going to learn how to use it. Um, you see, pi always crops up in, um, in, in nature. Um, here, you, you, here you've got a formula for the, for the, uh, period of one swing. So, so one swing like this is called one period. Now, uh, so, so you, you've, you, you've got a, a, a formula for, for the time it takes to, to make one swing. But why would, why would pi crop up in that formula? Well, why is it that pi keeps on cropping up everywhere? Well, the reason, every time you see pi, there's normally a circle involved somewhere. Remember, if, um, if, if, if I were to ask you, what, what is pi? Remember, pi is a distance, uh, around a circle, which is c, uh, divided by, uh, two, someone noticed that if, if you get the circumference, which is c, divided by two of the radius, it's, it's always pi. So pi really connects Connects, uh, the radius to the, uh, to the circumference. And, um, well, pi, every time there's a circle, there's, there's normally pi involved. Um, so here, the, the next question is, here you've got a formula for, for the period, for, 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 for the time it takes to, to make one swing. Why would pi crop up in this, in this, um, in, in, in this formula? Well, if, if you use your imagination here, the, here, it, there, there is a circle involved somewhere in here, and it's actually like this. I can't draw it properly, but there, there. Um, see, can you see a circle here, like, like, like this? It, it's, it's actually a circle. That's why, that's why pi crops up. If, if you look at the path of, of the, um, of the ball, it, it will move along a circle. That's why pi crops up in here. And you, you have to do physics to understand why it's like this. Okay. Well, anyway, um, how long will it take for a pendulum of two, two meters to make one swing? Well, start with a formula. We want to know t. Uh, so it's two pi, um, l. We know what l is. L is two. Okay. The length of, um, the length of the, uh, the string. We, um, and divided by g, we, we are no longer on earth. So we have to use, uh, gravity of, uh, of the moon. So 1.6 two two okay now um let's uh let's get a calculator out uh let, let's let's work out this uh this bubble here first so it would be uh two pi uh square root uh that that bubble there would be two divided by hang on two divided by uh one point six two two equals uh roughly one uh one Point two three. Now let's 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 square root it now. Okay, so it would be uh, two pi uh, square root it. Hang on, let me square root it. Square root this. It will be uh, one uh, one point one one. So so it's times one point one one. So so now you, you can visualize this as one thing multiplying this thing and then multiplying this thing. So let's. Let's get that, this number, times 2, and then times pi. Or you can get times pi and then times 2. It doesn't matter. So, times, times, uh, 2 equals, and then times pi equals, uh, so it would be, uh, 6.98, uh, 6 uh 6.98. Okay. Uh, let's, 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 uh, Let's just round up to, um, to, uh, seven seconds. So, th this number is, is very close to seven. Let, let's just say seven seconds. So, here, this, this pendulum, um, if, if you're on the moon, and, and then you, you, you have a length of two meters, it would take six seconds 
to make one swing. Um, in the previous, I think in the previous video, we worked it worked it out. If if you if you did this on on Earth, it would be uh, two point eight seconds, something like that. Um, on the moon, it would take it would take longer. It would take um, it would take what is it? Seven seconds. It would, it would take seven seconds on the moon. Um, remember, G G is like um, you, you can think of G as the strength of of um, of something pulling down on 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 this on this ball here on Earth. It's a lot stronger. It's um, it's nine point eight. Here it's only on the moon. It's only one point six. So you would expect it to take uh, take slightly longer on Jupiter, where where the gravity is uh, twenty three point something. Um, so, so that means the, the strength pulling on this thing, well, the pendulum on the Jupiter would take, uh, it, it would be a lot quicker, even, even quicker than on Earth. So you can work it out if you wanted to. Okay?